Hey guys, so for today's video I'm going to be doing my weekend morning routine and as you can tell I'm using a microphone for this video because I got it as a Christmas present from a boyfriend so yay, new things. So as you can tell I have woken up and just headed downstairs and filling the kettle up with some water because I want to make myself a tea. And I'm just putting the kettle on, letting it boil, and I'm actually using a loose leaf tea, which is a nice change because I also got that as a Christmas present as well for my sister's boyfriend, Dan. Um, and I chose a vanilla flavoured tea this morning because it was so nice. So I just put the little loose leaves in a little strainer, which he also brought me to go with it. And that acts as like the tea bag. Um, so you put that into the cup. Rupert wanted to join in because, you know, he just gets involved in everything. So put the strainer into the cup and pour the boiling water over it and let it sit for about three to five minutes. And you've got perfect vanilla flavoured tea. So here I am with my Urban Outfitters Crazy Cat Lady mug because I love this mug. And yeah, just sipping my tea, having a good time. Once I finish my tea, I'm going to head back upstairs and start to get ready for the day. So I'm just going to wash my face with some warm water and prep it for the Clarisonic that I'll be using in a minute. Uh, this is also a Christmas present from my sister and I'm actually using the travel size cleansing gel that came with it and it's really nice, it's quite a gentle cleanser but I think that's quite nice um, so my skin will get used to it. And honestly the Clarisonic feels amazing, especially in the morning it proper just wakes you up and makes your skin feel so clean and fresh and it makes a nice little lather and I just love it. It's like an electric toothbrush but for your face. And then I'm just following up with my simple rich moisturiser because I need to prep my skin for the makeup that I'll be applying later. And just rubbing that all in, making sure that it's all blended and also taking it down my neck. There we go, to make sure that everywhere is moisturised. And of course doing my teeth because we need to have clean teeth in the morning and at night as well. So for makeup I'm going to start off with my L'Oreal True Match foundation and I've actually mixed it with my simple rich moisturiser again just to kind of make it into a BB cream and this just provides a really nice light coverage of foundation but still gives me a little bit of something so I don't feel like I've got no foundation on at all. Um, I just like to wear it like this and just blend it in with my hands and it gives a nice tint of colour. Once that's blended in, I'm using my Collection Lasting Perfection Concealer just underneath my eyes and on a couple of spots. I'm not too bothered about covering everything because, well, I've only got a light layer and I'm not really doing much this weekend, so just want a bit of light coverage. And then I'm blending the concealer in with an Eco Tools concealer brush. I just like it this way, it makes a change because I haven't used this brush in a while. I'm now moving on to a cream blush from Revlon and I think it's in the shade Pinched. It's a nice like a corally orange and just applying that to the apples of the cheeks with my fingers and it just gives a really pretty hint of colour. Moving on to highlighter with my Benefit High Beam and just applying that with my fingers onto the tops of my cheekbones and I kind of applied quite a lot at this minute but I blend it in so it looks alright at the end. And then just going to take it in a C shape so take it onto my brow bone and then just put it in the inner corner. Blending it in with my fingers and then blending it again with a brush just to make sure that all the lines are seamless so then it doesn't look like I've got a harsh streak of highlighter and down the nose and on my cupid's bow as well just to finish it off. Moving on to brows and I'm just filling them in with my L'Oreal Brow Artist Plumper. This will just act as a brow gel and also give them a bit of tint and a bit of colour so I don't need to faff around with them too much. Moving down to eyes, I'm just going to use a Maybelline Colour Tattoo in Creamy Beige just as a bit of a base because I want something on my eyes but not too much. I'm just going to apply it with my finger and then blend it out with a blending brush. Then I'm going to take my Soap and Glory One Heck of a Block Powder and just use a real thinning setting brush and just set the concealer so just underneath my eyes and around my nose. I don't want to powder everywhere because so I don't want to look too cakey or look like I've got too much makeup on, just the areas that are going to get oily the quickest, just to make sure it doesn't slip and slide everywhere. 
Now finishing off the eyes, I'm going to just apply some Maybelline Falsies Mascara. This one's kind of dried out, but I still absolutely love it. I mainly apply the mascara to my top lashes, but I will also put a tiny little bit on my lower lashes as well. This will just finish off the eyes. And to finish off the makeup look, I'm going to apply the Maybelline lipstick, and I think it's in the shade Tantalizing Taupe. Um, it's really, really pretty nude with just, it's quite creamy, it's just really easy to wear and I love this for an everyday basis. Now that the makeup's finished, I'm just going to fiddle around with my hair and I've just gone for a simple one at the back of my head and pulled down my fringe bits. Um, decided to wear my glasses today instead of my contact lenses, just for a bit more of a casual look. So a bit of awkward posing and there we go. My shoes that I've got on are from ASOS, they're just like these Timberland style boots and jeans are from Hollister, just some simple black jeans and Darcy decided to arrive at this bit and get some fuss because she wanted to go out for a walk. Jumper is also from Hollister and it's in this gorgeous teal colour which I absolutely adore. Recently got this and it's so comfortable and so warm. My coat is from Oasis and I've had it for a couple of years but it's still just as comfortable and just as warm. It's amazing and I love it. Now that I'm all ready, I'm just going to take Darcy out for a walk and this then concludes my weekend morning routine. Twitter, Instagram and Snapchat will all be in the description box so go ahead and follow me on there. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my channel and thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye!